former Guns N' Roses and current Velvet Revolver bassist Duff McKagan has been quite busy during the band's hiatus. Besides releasing the album Sick by his side project Duff McKagan's Loaded, he's also been writing a financial column for Playboy. Already with articles touching on subjects like the pros and cons of capitalism, Ponzi and Madoff, and when the banks go bankrupt, Duff continues to draw on his financial knowledge in the reoccurring column. While Duff got his start writing weekly columns for the Seattle Weekly, Playboy immediately recognized his talents and gave him the creative reins over his column, Duffonomics. Artisan News Service caught up with Duff recently to get his thoughts on being approached by Playboy to write a financial column. I was 30 years old and looking around and realizing I thought I was alone and not knowing what, how money worked and, you know, and I'd made some money and I didn't, I'd heard all the, the bad stories about the bands getting ripped off and the artists getting ripped off and I didn't want to be one of those guys and I was too embarrassed to ask anybody like what a, all that financial news on TV meant. Um, so I, I went to school, I, I got into a class, and from that class I got into another class and I started eyeballing schools I actually wanted to get into, and got into Seattle U, which has a uh, high-ranking business school there. He also talked about Playboy wanting to find someone a little off-kilter and hip to write their financial column. They're trying to pimp out the Playboy.com and make it like a, a place where people go for not just to look at naked chicks, but to also get like music news and try to make it sort of young and hip, I suppose. And so for business news, they wanted to find somebody who was a little off kilter, like, huh, he's writing about finance? And uh, so they approached me. I, I'm kind of the guy, if, if I haven't tried something and it's put in my lap, I'll try it once. You know, and see how it feels. And so I'm in my, uh, I don't know, I think my 10th week with Playboy. And I can kind of write about whatever I want to, financial. Velvet Revolver continued to search for a vocalist to replace Scott Weiland. Although there were other reports the band were set to announce a replacement, that never was the case, and the search continues. In the meantime, Slash continues to work on his soon-to-be-released solo album, and Duff will head out on another tour in support of Sick. Duff McKagan's loaded tour dates kick off October 7th in Ireland and extend until October 24th in the UK.